Hey, and I appreciate you too, just as much as I appreciate myself. Y'all are wonderful people. Thank you. Thank and I feel blessed to meet y'all. Oh, uh, so I feel blessed to meet you guys. Yes.
I saw that some people, people, some people might feel like, uh, like what we hear in the news. You know, they, they, you know, they might feel like, like that compared to what I saw in the world of this prayer life. And when I, and got when I was there, there, it was okay. okay. It was it was kind of when I came back, we'd be out there, but it's terrible. Like, adapting back to the normal life, us just standing here was horrible. And I lost, like, I turned my back on the Like, I hated God. I hated God for what He let me see. Like something switched in. Right? And, and I realized that what I did was out of the goodness of my heart. I meant no evil though. I meant no evil. A man, a man is only capable of as much good as he's taught. Plain and simple. If you're taught evil for your whole life, and it's the right thing, then you can be evil for your whole life. Which is what those people were taught. And I hold nothing against those people anymore. For a while, I think. The, the, the whole Muslim I find uh, of, of genre, you know what I'm mean? saying? I, I, I pass that up. And now, I thoroughly believe what you know, all of my life. I enjoy the bad in the God expects me to live by the best of their ability, by the best of God, what they're taught. Because if you were never taught the word of God, you would have no point about it. Right, exactly. Okay, so, so these people were taught that we were there. And they were taught by the word of Allah. Now, if I taught you by the word of Allah, you be a whole life, which is completely evil. It degrades women, it degrades other cultures, right? it degrades other society, how much time it other communities. Right? But, but these people live by the word that they were taught, and I don't believe they can be judged by their actions. I believe they can be judged by their actions. I believe they can be judged by their commitment to the word that they were taught. Because it's not fair for a man to be judged by what he was taught. It's fair for a man to be judged by what he responds to what he was taught. If you were taught, you right, is that right? You're not going to be judged according to the Bible. What God, I'm just trying to get God has revealed to you. Right. And these people were never revealed to God. We know it's all. And I, as a youth, I was revealed to God as in the church. I was revealed to God as you go bring money and you be free. Now, if I would have stayed in that community, that was what I would have believed my whole life. And I don't believe that God can judge you by what you've been taught. I believe God can judge you by what you've been taught and what you follow. Because, because there's no way that a God over all men would judge a man. If I taught you, if I taught you one plus one equals four, your whole life. And God says, what's one plus one? And you say four. He can't judge you for getting that question wrong. But
Can you send me that word that says revive? Living by false judgment, because that's a man's comprehension of God's word. Is it not? And, and I'll tell you a big thing about what my belief, my biggest belief about religion was. The Roman Catholic took religion and they revised it to control the one and even. And that's horrible. And it's become such a play. It's become such a play. But the bottom line is, there's only one man about Yes, sir. You're right. Hey, hey, they try, and they try to cover his word so hard. They try to cover his word so hard. Yeah. Have you not seen uh, God's I word trying to be relationship? Oh, yeah. Have you not seen it? Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. A rapist yeah. of a young child. And when you got a habit, maybe four years in prison and let go. Yeah. What would God have done if he lived that? You would have been convicted on the spot. Uh, from my understanding in the Bible, he would have been convicted. What about a murder? He would have been convicted on the spot. If God could come down the earth and convict a murderer or a rapist, what would he do? He wouldn't do it because we know, we know it's human. You can't be in the air, barricaded, and such and such. Right. That's all, man. Promise can be delivered, you know. God can deliver. But we can feel all the pain. And I believe, I believe in my life that every wrong decision that I've made, that the quote-unquote format has caught up with me. In the highest point in my life, like, it doesn't catch up with me when I'm doing bad. When I'm doing bad, nothing, there's no karma. When I get on top, like my highest point, that's the karma. I'll just get back down. And I believe that as a, as a good person in the world, God, no God, whatever. This is a good place to be doing when you get knocked down and you climb back up. That's what God's going to do. Not to fall into the trap. Yeah, we're really going to need another time. Yeah. 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 By the light that was shown on you. Right. And it's word. And a lot of us will be here full count. And some of us will come without a lot of time. Especially this nation. That's why it's going to be here full count. Of the nation. Oh, nation. We've had the gospel preach every corner. I don't know what you're Right. I ain't never met nobody in America that hadn't known of Christ and heard of it. Foreign country, I've been some. It's a different thing. And then we're going to be held accountable. One more. Well, sir, it was a pleasure. Well, same here. Pleasure meeting you too, man. Y'all have a wonderful night. Yeah, Nanny. I swear. She's from Lake Charles. Think about this, sir. If I close my eyes and heard your wings, I would see everybody. Sunday morning, we... Are you telling her I said hi? Oh, well, good. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. And y'all have a wonderful night. Really, thank y'all for coming. Thank you. 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 Yeah, but I did it, so. Oh, doing good. Good.